What's good, YouTube? It's your girl, Taylor Yanni, T A Y L O R A Y A N I. And today, today I'm gonna be doing a life update. I'm gonna be answering some questions that I have been avoiding and you know i'm going to be asking questions that y'all you know want to know because like it's been a while it's been a good little minute that i actually have did a realistic life update slash q a type of thing and a lot has happened since then so i need to update y'all and i feel like y'all like deserve to know some of these things not all these things because some of y'all just be want to be in my business for no reason but Y'all need to update y'all, let y'all know the real tea. Cause I'm keeping real. Whatever wherever I go, wherever, wherever I do. Like I'm keeping real. I'm gonna keep it one hundred. Like ain't no sugar coat, ain't no ain't no Yeah. But make sure y'all like, comment, share, and subscribe. And make sure you tell a friend to tell a friend and tell a friend to subscribe. Because if you're not subscribing and if you're not subscribed to tell a friend, then what are you really doing? Like you're not living life. But yeah, y'all. Let's get on to the video. All right, so I asked my Instagram questions on my little iPad mini. Oh, that's so cute. Being who I've been, I asked my Instagram like earlier today. And yeah, let's look at these questions. And I'm gonna answer like the simple ones first. Okay, first question is, how old are you? I'm 16. I turned 16 September 19th, but I'm 16 years old. A lot of people think I'm older than what I am, but I'm 16. I promise y'all, I'm 16. I was born in 07. How school? School, school is school. I mean, school is school. School gonna be school regardless. Like, I can say school was like, school was more stress free younger. Cause like you barely have all these like tests and like exams and all these, all these hardcore classes. But like, yeah. Like school, school is gonna get like, more stressful and like more difficult and more like ugh when you get older because you get older you lose friends you earn friends you gain friends you gain relationships and bonds you lose bonds and all that stuff a lot of stuff happened in high school so if you're in elementary school and you're watching this enjoy your elementary school years why last and why you can't because high school is a whole different breed and you got to get hip to you know Cause everybody ain't your friend, everybody ain't your partner. You know what I'm saying? And you gotta watch out for the fakes. Like you gotta put people in categories, separate the real from the fakes and from all that. But just watch out. If y'all want me to do that advice, comment down below. Cause I got a lot to say. Um, how was homecoming? Homecoming was cool. Homecoming was fun. I wish the dress up day was a little more like. I mean that was fun, but I wish it was like a little more out there. And I wish my school showed more school spirit and school pride, and that way it can make it fun for everybody. And when I, yeah. how tall are you? This, this is not sound like a life update right now, but hey, it is what it is. How tall are you? Today I went to the doctor and I found that I was five two. I feel like somebody lying, but it ain't me because ain't no way Tiller or Yanni is five two. But according to doctors, I'm sixty two inches, and you can break that in the feet. I'm five two. So yeah. How you been? This is a good one. I've been okay. I want to say I've been the best but i've been okay like i'm still living like god god woke me up this morning i'm doing good like, i'm doing i won't say i'm doing better than some because i don't know how everybody else is living but i'm doing like good good like i could be better but i've been okay like i'm still here like i'm i'm doing it day by day baby going day by day hour by hour minute by minute like i'm making it i'm making it I thank God I'm still here because a lot of people don't even make it to 16. Matter of fact, like a lot of people, but yeah, I'm here. Like, I'm not like depressed or anything, not that I know of, but like, I could be a lot better. But some stuff I can't fix. And I have the habit, the habit of thinking I can control everything when I know I can't. But yeah, if that makes sense. But. Not getting too deep into that. Do you have a crush on any of the filmers with Kanika? Is that correct grammar? 
I know, I know what you mean, but no, I do not. I do not have any crushes on anybody that filmed with Kanika or WTO Squad. None of that. Um, am I dating right now? No, I'm not dating right now. How's life so far? Life as a whole, life has been good to me. Like, I have been blessed with so many things that I couldn't even imagine. And, like, I'm still, you know, getting blessed as the days goes on. Because, like, even waking up is a blessing. But, like, life has been good. I mean, life is not always fair. And life is not always, you know, great and wonderful. You might have your days. But, like, life is good. Life is good. But, like, like I said, not always. Because, like, you always got, like, if it's one thing... It's another after that, after that thing. And after that thing, it's a whole nother one. But, like, life has its ups and downs. But, like, right now, I'm stress-free, bill-free. Like, I don't have to pay no bills, but my subscriptions and all that extra stuff. But, like, life is good. Like, I have, like, no really, like, hardcore major responsibility to take, of, to take care of. So, why would I be stressing? All the other stuff that I may be stressing about, like, all that can really, like, you know, I can, that can get dealt with or like get did it but um yeah um mm. who's your best friend wtl squad i don't have a best friend wtl squad i don't have a best friend at all period like my best friends really myself because i'm gonna never switch up on me like if if everybody else like part ways with me you know i always have myself you know you feel me like i always have me because like yeah um do you miss cam Nah, I don't. Mm -mm, I don't miss Kim. Um, what grade are you in? I am a sophomore in high school, and if you don't know what a sophomore is, a sophomore is a tenth grader in high school. So, your second year in high school. I have two more, y'all. I got this year and two more left. After that, I'm out of the like. I'm out of the like. I'm out of the. Um, how are you mentally? Like I said earlier, like I'm okay. I can be better, but like I don't. I'm not the type of person that really express my emotions i mean i might like cry here and there about like i might tell you how i'm feeling but it's like the whole story and like i'm the type of person that will hide how i'm feeling but if you know me and you've been around me for like a good amount of time then you know it's something wrong with me like i might tell you something but that don't mean like it's the whole thing if that makes sense but man, still, i'm okay i could be better but like i said i'm okay like i'm still i'm making it day by day i could be better but like I can't say these last couple of weeks or this last month, I have been a little off. And like, it's not just one thing. It's like multiple, it's like multiple things, like just pulling from different areas that's making me this way and getting me in this little funk. It's not just like one particular thing. Like, I feel like multiple things have been pulling on me from different aspects and different areas of my life that now it's just like with the freak like it's just like you either gonna get yourself together or you're gonna stay in this funk and which one you gonna do because at this point these things that are weighing you down half of these things can be prevented and half of these things you can let go but then again you can't let go because of the type of bond and the type of attachment you had over it and you just can't let go if that makes sense and like it's just like wow and it's like you trying your best to keep it together but reality are you really okay but like you're not actually okay you're just saying you're okay to to get your mind in the process of believing that you're okay but you're really not okay i ate that up didn't me but yeah like i could be a lot better than what i am now but yeah we're making it day by day getting over it day by day and i feel like and holding in your emotions is not gonna make it no better i've learned that the hard way and i'm going through it right now but i feel like if you're not gonna tell nobody at least probably like write it down talk to yourself you know do what you gotta do i might start writing my feelings down i might because holding it in ain't gonna make it no better and as you keep holding in eventually you're gonna explode and burst and you're gonna let it on the wrong people and on the wrong in the wrong crowd and you're gonna end up in a worse situation than where she is now because you're not telling people that's around you that actually care about you and you let it out on one of them it's gonna be a bad outcome so it's yeah yeah do you think you and Amarion can become friends again y'all had a good friendship before everything i don't really have a problem with Amarion. now 
you really got me when you said y'all had a good friendship. I, mm, I feel like what y'all see on camera versus off camera is like it's two different perspectives, and you don't really know a person. Like you only know what you see, like what y'all watch on YouTube, and everything that y'all watch is like, is like y'all think what y'all watch is, happens like the exact time and like the exact thing happens outside of camera reality it don't like it's a whole different ball game but that's all i'm gonna say you haven't been consistent with posting on youtube y'all i have posted in like 12 days like it haven't been been two weeks yet but i'm back and i bet i posted the video what yesterday i posted the video on the 9th i don't know when this video dropping but i posted the video on the 9th and this is the 10th like y'all it's been 12 days like my bad, I'm sorry. I had to get my mind right. Um, are you single? Yes, I am very much single. After what happened this past, I don't know, after all this and what I see in different relationships, like from the outside looking in and from the inside also looking out, I don't want no relationships. Y'all do too much for me. Um, are you and O still talking? No, we're not still talking. Matter of fact, I haven't talked to O like he haven't said it to me like we have been talking whatsoever do you think youtube has impact your mental health i feel like youtube like at times youtube does bother my mental in a way because i feel like i have a lot of people like depending on me and stuff like that but i wouldn't say like I would say recently it has impacted my mental health. Like, made a difference with my mental health. Not in a good way, more so in a bad way. But I'm getting better. I'm recovering. So, yeah. But it's just a whole lot of like YouTube. YouTube is not easy. YouTube is stressful at times. It can get you down. It can get you out of your out of your 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 state. Like it can like yeah yeah but like yeah yeah okay now i see this question a lot are you still in wto did you leave wto are you still filming with wto members like why haven't you been in videos are you still in wto did you leave wto why haven't you been with WTO? Can I get a drum roll? <laughs> Y'all. Am I still in WTO? Nah, I'm not in WTO anymore, y'all. I'm not in WTO no more. I'm going to say a couple of things. And I'm going to get out your way. Everybody ain't your friend. And everybody ain't your partner. Everybody ain't no real nigga. But if I say I got you. I got you. Hey. I'm not in WTO no more y'all. Yeah, y'all might. Y'all might unsubscribe y'all might leave my channel y'all might just probably mess with me because i was with wtl but i'm not in wtl no more y'all they booted me and scooted me and they trumped up the deuces and i don't mean this to be messy or anything because I, I righteously still do have love for them like it ain't no bad blood at least on my end ain't no bad blood or no beef like, I still love them as if they were my own family and own blood, even though, like, almost half of them are related and probably have a more closer bond than I did with them. But, in no bad blood, I still love them. I, I appreciate the opportunity. I, like, enjoy every minute we had together. Ain't no bad beef and no bad blood, but just know I'm not in WTO no more. Now, will I still be doing YouTube on my channel? Yes, just because I'm not in WTO no more don't mean I can't stop posting on my channel. Either y'all gonna watch it or you're not gonna watch it. And that's point blank period. But 
so no more WCL content. Now, from what I was told, I still can feel with Kanegra, but I'm just not filming with like that whole crew and whole like squad because that's a whole like that's a whole football team of people right there. But yeah, do you have a religion? I would say I'm Christian because like that's how I was brought up and raised. So I would say I'm a Christian from what from my understanding. I love God. You don't love God? What's wrong with you? Okay. Do you sincerely still like Amarion? No, I do not like Amarion. And, and a lot of y'all are mad at me about the situation, but reality, reality, y'all don't know the whole story. Because, like, yeah, I went on live, which I probably should have never did that. But in my opinion, I really thought we was for NT because you can't expect we all, you can't expect me to think we all locked in and ex boom coon and shook a dude and then booted up, tooted up, scooted up, then a whole different way off camera. Like, you can't be expecting to be locked in with C-A-Y-L-O-R-A-Y-A-N-I when you're feeling with the whole squad. Oops, said too much. I'm my bad. I'm sorry. But no, because, like, y'all come from me. In my comments, in my DMs, in my like, in my whole grill, in my Kool Aid, I don't even know the flavor. Talking about something. Oh, you did. Oh, wrong. Oh, oh, you fumbled. Oh, oh, you ugly anyway. I ain't like you. I mean, I don't even know the whole story. I'm not even gonna get into it because, like, that stuff like happened like how long ago? And I ain't gonna make a video about it. Like, like, I ain't even gonna make a video about it. Like, like if y'all want a video, that's a whole, that's a whole different story. Cause I'm gonna get my subscribers what they want. But, like, I'm not even gonna make no video to bash nobody. Cause I ain't trying to bash nobody. I ain't trying to do people how they do me. But, like, you can't expect us to be one way. Like, you playing mind games. You think you wanna be with T-A-Y-L-R-A-Y. And I. But, reality over there doing, doing your own little thing. Baby, you giving me mixed things. At this point, I don't even know what he is. Baby, at this point, what he is? Gang in this. Gang in this. What? Not front. Then he front on TikTok. Let's not front. Like, like. Like, I wasn't the main one trying to give our followers some love, trying to give you some real love. Because, baby, I give nothing but genuine love. So, don't ever do that. Because, baby, that's not even in my blood. I don't even play with folks like that. Because I don't want to be played with. Do I look like a, a PS5 to you? No. Next caller. Anywho. Hey, what you said? I'm only 16 and I'm doing my thing. Miss Taylor, I can't even remember the name. I'm booked, they're busy, they're keeping up with me. They do everything just to please the city. And when speaking on Taylor, I'm my own individual. I made my own with y'all. So unpredictable blessings on blessings. Blessings on blessings. I don't need to get typical. I do what I want because I hate authority. Stepping on this like I'm in a sorority. Give my money. They give my money is my top priority. Never care what y'all say. Y'all really ignore me. Your girlfriend. Yeah, I know she really adore me. I'm just so fly. She's trying to export me. She's so ambitious. She's not a recording. Um, oh, but I said, do you like doing YouTube or is it like stressful? Sometimes it is not coming up with like a five video idea. Cause like when you're a YouTuber, YouTubers more, more seem to like, or more tend to try to come up with video ideas that will like go up per se like as in views and go up because like being a youtuber if you have like this five video idea and it don't get that many views it might hurt because it's like dang like i thought this video was gonna be so fine and it don't give the amount of attention that you thought it was gonna do then yeah but at this point hey hey do what you got hey if you, if you think your video fine post it it might not get the attention you wanted to get now but a couple weeks later go go look go knock on that door and see and see what it's talking about i give me some time like because you gotta think about it it's all like it's all just like a whole i want to say game but like you gotta you gotta you gotta pick 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 your i want to say pick your poison but like you, you gotta find your own puzzle to the like you gotta find your own puzzle piece to the puzzle like you gotta you gotta figure and do your research yourself and how your channel works and how your channel grow and how your how your what is called analytics and all that and like the formula of your YouTube channel and how your you know but yeah but at times it can be stressful though and like it can weigh on your mental sometimes.
but that's really it y'all that's all i really got for y'all today y'all want me to do a part two comment down below um yeah y'all if y'all like this video please like comment share and subscribe make sure you tell a friend to tell a friend and tell a friend to subscribe because if you're not subscribed tell a young today what are you doing because like this the place this the best channel to be like this the best place to be like this the best place to watch all the all the lit content all the all the real not the fake but yeah y'all i'll be back with more videos I need to know just how you feel it.